Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Makita if you're new and as you can see by the title today's video is going to be a five okay maybe six perfumes every girl needs in a collection. Honestly, I obviously like perfume, but obviously I didn't need to have not obviously but I didn't necessarily have the money to like get the ones I wanted but now as I get older um I've been gifted and I've bought a couple more perfumes and I kinda like building my collection but still as far myself going back to these five kind of six perfumes like for different occasions as my number ones you know what I mean so I just want to share with you guys my five okay six perfumes that I recommend that all girls should have in a collection for all different events and all different times and times and occasions and yeah I have some affordable some expensive and yeah all over so i hope you guys enjoyed the video and let me know where's your favorite perfume because i love perfume so i want to know all of the um kinds of the likes i could go and buy some <laughs> see ya. catch up by me you guys sit down relax grab a drink grab something to eat let me see i'm talk about some perfume and some smell good okay guys so i literally have my notes here don't watch my horror band writing um so you can get into it i also go and try to put up the notes of each fragrance on the screen when i talk about it i am not a perfume connoisseur so i don't know about much about notes i know like some notes like i pick out some but for the most part i could just sell it it's when it's sweet spicy what kind of occasion good for that kind of thing okay so the first perfume i'm going to talk about is girly everyday okay so when i say girly everyday i mean like it's still a perfume but it's something you can wear like you could give your daughter to go to school with or you could um Especially if she accustomed to like buy somebody else but she wants to like be feel like she she wanna feel more elevated like she wanna actually have a perfume, I would say get this one. Or like if she does or if you yourself just want something a little more um not childish but a little more playful, more flirty, more light, airy, I would recommend the Ariana Grande Sweet Like Candy. It looks like this, it's so cute and it smells so so good. So the notes are here, I'm gonna read up the notes for you guys. So the top notes for sweet like candy are uh, blackberry. Um, pear, bergamot, and then the middle notes are uh, whipped cream, marshmallow, black currant, frangipani, jasmine, honeysuckle. I think that's it. Yeah, jasmine, honeysuckle. And the base notes are vanilla and cashmere wood. I don't know about all that. Well, I can say this smells really, really sweet. And a little bit playful, but also I feel like it have a little bit of like not a teenager like it still smells like my age i'm 22 and i feel like it kind of smells like my age like it doesn't smell too old but it doesn't smell too young I feel like it's a very good mix of perfume because the longevity is not the best you put it on maybe you get like about three hours to four hours so it doesn't last that long but i feel like it will still be a very good perfume to have and it's a very good mixer to um just to sweeten up any other perfume i have beside it um especially for the time like if you're just going to work or if you're just going to school or if you're just going like like somewhere it's just chill vibes i feel like this is a really good perfume to have sorry but you're outside noises you guys so yeah, this is an grande sweet like candy okay guys so the next perfume i have is date night perfume and my recommendation is the black opium intense okay so first of all the bottle is so cute is like a black sparkly butter with like a blue hue to it um i'll get into the notes just now but i do want to say people like i said i thought it sent overplayed but i don't find so i find it smells so good and also maybe it's overplayed in america but in trinidad and i think there's so much compliments people saying like it smells so different it smells so good so anybody says overplayed i don't know what you're talking about so let me get into the notes so the notes are a lot of words i cannot really pronounce so absinthe essence blackberry that is top nose um i think that is it yeah black i think because i kind of have a duck my hand is crazy just ish. middle nose is licorice absolute orange blossom jasmine sandback absolute i think that is it and then the base note is black coffee accord vanilla absolute and sandalwood so this perfume I feel like everybody smells already, but this is the intense version, so it lasts way longer. But this perfume smells so good. It's it basically have like a coffee note, even though yeah, it's a coffee and a yeah, black coffee accord. It smells I don't really know what notes to say notes, but it just smells so good. It literally smells so sexy. Men are literally be complimenting you left, right, and center. This smells so good. So this is definitely a, 
and nighttime scent though because the smell is so strong i feel like it's just not giving daytime it's a little bit too strong for daytime this is definitely giving off our vibe of just sexy date night also the girls just nighttime it smells so good like you'll be getting compliments left right and center so good Okay guys, so my third perfume is like super sweet. Somebody who wants something super sweet, either to mix with your other perfumes or just likes the super sweet scents. I'll have to say it's Azaro Wanted Girl. This is my most recent purchase perfume and it looks like this. Hopefully, hopefully it focuses. It looks like a grenade or a bomb or something like that. It's just so cool and you can actually spray it out like that. Ooh, it smells so good all from the top here. Um, this perfume is actually like for something in Trinidad and Pennywise and I actually believe that Pennywise sell real, real products like I ask the girls on them and I honestly really think it, is, it does sell real products so up to you if you want to do that if you go order, order it online or buy it from like 5 cents really up to you I don't know but yeah so let me just get into the notes with this one so this one has top notes of ginger flower orange blossom um, pomegranate and pink pepper and the middle notes are dosa leche and datura i'm not sure what that is and the base notes is tonka bean patchouli and haitian haitian vetiver so this is just real sweet this smells so good i just get so much compliments on this one as well it does last real long um the first time i tried it out i put it on me and after i went five island for my son's birthday and it lasted me the whole day while i was going through chlorine and was hand slicing it's still on my hand like that when i know i was like i had to go back and buy this but for something almost 500 dollars for a perfume that lasts in whole day and smelling so good have to buy it so this perfume is a must especially if it's very very sweet so it, i mean it's very very sweet though so if you don't really like sweet scents or you might get a headache then i wouldn't recommend it okay very sweet i love this perfume so much probably one of my favorites right now and I feel like it definitely needed it. Like, if you like sweet scents, you will love this. Okay, guys, so the next one we're getting into some affordable ones right now. So, this one, um, this is more like a local brand. I don't know if I see it, I see it guys on Amazon or eBay, but I wouldn't really put a link down because I don't know if it's like the real one or fake one. I don't know, I don't know. So, I feel kind of weird putting the link, but if you live in Trinidad, you can get this in Pennywise for $99. I know. Normally, I don't buy perfume like this on Pennywise, but my, my sister, which is basically my, my niece, um, mother, but that's what she was sister. She um she recommended she recommended this to me like years ago, and this literally you will never guess it's a um, Pennywise perfume. It's very very strong. You see how much I use from it. It's very very strong. It does last very long. It kind of have an alcohol scent, but it does go away. And after this smell is so nice, it gives boss lady like this is give boss woman. This way so this way I had a way to go to work. Um, you can even when it's a date night, you can wear this all year round. It smells so good, so strong, and yeah, I love it. So we're getting to the notes. So the notes I could have find was top is um neroli and malfi lemon. Then the middle was raspberry, jasmine, African orange, flower, gardenia, patchouli, white honey, and then the base notes was amber. So that's why I find I don't know that exactly what's inside of it, but it, all I know is to tell you earlier, it smells real good. It, it's literally 99 dollars So what you have to lose, just go into Pennywise and find gift set and buy it. If you don't like it, they can just give somebody else it. But I promise Oli Oli will like it. It smells so good. And it's it, like you will never guess. You will never guess it's from um Pennywise. Oh sorry, I just fixed my top. But you will never guess it's from Pennywise. Like it smells so good. Oli should try it and like tell me tell me in the comments what you think about it. Tell me. Okay guys, so the fifth one is your body spray. So this is our bottom but I had to mention our bottom body. So we all know it doesn't last that long, but we all know the scent is always be banging. So let's not get into it. So this one is, as I say, is a your yeah, everyday body spray. They some ways wanna wear it to like, you wanna go in the grocery, you wanna go in the shop, you wanna go just like, like easy places. They wanna go for, you wanna go in the even time and go buy Eddie had to buy some, some tacos. Like, just like, you know, I don't like do too much. This is it because it's still strong enough to smell it, but it's not like, you know, like feel like you're wasting perfume, you know what I mean? So, but somebody else really have like extensive notes. I just can't read the notes at the, at the back of the bottle. And it says it has um pomegranate nectar, fresh orange blossom, vanilla bean, and warm amber. Um supposedly there's a dupe for YSL Libre and or Libre. <laughs> um I never actually get to smell that one. Um if you guys want to go to a really, really nice bougie perfume shop that has like baccarat rouge, um check out West Mall 
it have a store called fifth fifth sensations or fifth sense i can't remember which one you can find it on my instagram as well i'll try to leave them down below in the description they have one in um sea tree as well them have like all the perfume like all the perfumes you could think of from from beyonce type perfumes like like celebrity brands to all the way to like baccarat rouge they have it and they have this thing i'm um, called like decanter where you where how to say they were like they have like small little vials i have a travel size pocket to create in and you get 10 10 ml of um any kind of perfume you want to get 10 ml of baccarat rouge for just a cheaper price so you haven't you could get some like some famous perfumes for just a lower price so that is so cool but anyways that's again back to the libre so you see that they have libre day but they do there's never have a um test of them to smell so up to now i'm never gonna smell it but that's the next perfume on my list like i really want to get a perfume even though i never smelled it before but since people say that this i do fit and this Good. I now know I need to go and buy the YSL lip because this is, smells so good. This is the best bottom body perfume I ever get hands down. If you ever find this perfume or whatever you ever find this body spray, get it. Like just grab it. Grab as much as it could because you know bottom body doesn't always keep back the same poop, same sense. But this smells so good and the packaging is so cute, you guys. It's so cute. Hopefully it's focusing on it. I mean, I love this perfume so much. It's body body spray. You know what I mean but yeah it smells so good and so affordable case but i'm body so yeah okay guys i'm going on and on about this six perfume so this one is just an honorable mention this one is the unique one but also is like a mixable flavor this is you make this with anything and it will make everything better and this is ariana grande cloud hopefully it focuses on it hopefully you guys okay this is ariana grande cloud this perfume, let's get your nose and then we get into it. So the nose, the top nose is lavender, pear and bergamot. The middle nose is whipped cream, praline, coconut and vanilla orchid. And the base nose is musk and woody notes. This perfume is so weird. At first, when I first smell it, it kind of gives me chlorine pool toys. I know, it kind of gives me that. But then afterwards, it just gets so sweet and different like i can't even describe it all you yeah it just gets so different afterwards like you have to smell this face up supposedly this as well as i do for baccarat which 540 and never smell baccarat shoes 540 some people say it's a dupe some people say it's kind of but not really so i don't know but this it smells so good um it don't it doesn't really last on me that long but um but when i mix with other perfumes it just make my other perfume it smells so much better so I recommend this so much. I recommend this so much. It doesn't last that long on me, but when I mix it with other fragrances, it lasts really long. So the point of my brother, and I feel like it's unisex, unisex, cause my brother literally just come and try to like not steal, but like he just come and use his perfume as well, and he just get rare compliments from girls in, in secondary school, high school, for the same perfume. So boys and girls go wait it smells so good it smells so different like people always ask it like way away and they will, know, they will be like it's smelling good but they'll be like way away and it's so different so i really recommend this and Ariana Grande perfumes are really affordable it's like a celebrity perfume so i really 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 recommend this it smells really good so overall i would say my most long last summer is obviously black opium it's more money but it does like i always put that on and the next day my clothes and the wash will literally still be smelling that's strong like that perfume is strong and the least one probably would be the other one sweet like candy but for what does this use it for like just for every day just for like you know it, it's not really that deep you know what i mean i probably the bottom body also but yeah as I, I hope but yeah that's basically it my favorite one i can't pick a favorite as i say everything have a certain time and a certain place yeah everything has a certain time and place for it and i just really feel like these perfumes when they have these perfumes they basically set for any occasion like any occasion you come and you're smelling real good okay so i hope you guys enjoyed the video let me know down below where's all your um free perfumes because i love perfumes so any perfume you want to get i will definitely look into them i hope you guys enjoyed the video and i'll see you guys in my next one thank you so much for watching don't forget to comment like and subscribe and share and yeah i'll see you guys in my next one Bye.